Hi guys, it's me UB Programmer and from this video we're gonna start a series on Python programming and in the whole series if you feel uh, you don't uh, grasp any concept or you have some doubt you can contact me directly on the WhatsApp or maybe contact me through this mail or just fill out this form even if you are uh, doing any custom project in uh, Python or in any uh, framework you can contact me uh, through this form right uh, so that we can uh, see what we can do about it okay let uh, get started and uh, consider subscribing the channel uh, you will get the content about AI MLDL uh, then computer science software engineering uh, in general and we're gonna start a, a series on lang chain also uh, really soon okay so what IDE we are using for this series I'm using the favorite uh, VS code uh, I think everyone uses it so I guess uh, it's super clear let's make a file for uh, first tutorial as tutorial.py and what we're gonna cover today uh, comments I'm gonna cover it just right now by writing a comment okay so this is a comment where I'm writing what I'm gonna cover so it's not get compiled in my code okay uh, let's say I want to cover uh, first of all comments I have just covered it okay so no more uh, like time on that then we have to cover uh, how we're gonna print anything to our console then and it's already covered print so Python is really really simple <laughs> uh, two things are covered but we're gonna see the practicals okay print then uh, we have variables so basically getting started so this is getting started so that we can see our setup is running and we don't have any issues with it obviously you have to install python by just uh, python install right here you will go to here and if you get any problem by in execution of code uh, feel free to contact me i will uh, try to debug it for you okay and you just download it and just install it on as per your operating system first of all let's see how we can uh, print anything i'll print my name Obed Ahmed. let's print it python one.py and this is believe me this is best, uh, best practice to compile the code as when uh, you will feel it when you will be using frameworks like flask django and all and one thing i want to tell you this whole series will be focused on uh, ai perspective because i am an ai engineer so my uh, focus will be mainly on AI but for the model deployment in AI we use uh, web frameworks like Django, Flask and APIs so we're gonna cover that and it will be a huge series okay uh, I mean four to five frameworks will be covered okay let's uh, compile this program Python then file name hit enter and you get over uh, Good. Uh, now let's see what are the variables. So this is print. Then uh, I will say variables, and this whole uh, source code will be available in the description. So feel free to check it out. Now I don't want to uh, give my name directly in the print statement. What I want is store my name somewhere and then print it out. So I can create a variable for that and variable is gonna contain my name but why we're seeing these yellow red lines because everything which is character or which is a uh, text we have to wrap it around these quotation marks so that python know that it's a, a string and it can contain uh, characters and why why these are important this is 
basically in the syntax of python and i guess probably every programming language and so you have to uh, like remember this syntax but uh, googling it is better way than i would say remembering because uh, when you will write code 10 to 15 times you're gonna remember it any day okay uh, now let's see if we get results so two time uh, where am I? my name okay uh, one time with the directly print statement second time with the variables okay cool but what are variables uh, we, we don't like understand it through this only storing values so one uh, characteristic of them is that they can store values the other is they can change values so I can just uh, change the name to Elon Musk okay. uh, but let's keep it that way and then we create an updation for that so Elon Musk now let's see what happens so you can see first is because of this line the second print statement is rendering Elon Musk and not rendering OBAZAMR because it is variable and it can uh, the value can be very right so it is getting updated in the line number seven so this is the whole concept for the print and variable I hope it gets you started with the uh, programming and I'm pretty sure uh, you can uh, like figure out this stuff uh, in the in the like uh, running things but if you get stuck you can always uh, text me down okay so I hope uh, this gets the clear uh, picture for the series and I will see you uh, I will see you in the next video thanks for watching